hi lovies a official welcome to my channel today's video is gonna be a birthday glam I did on my sister it also includes snippets from her photo shoot that she did for her birthday so if you want to see how I achieve this look on my lovely sister just keep on watching I had already done her eyebrows and primed her eyes off camera so we moved on to blending of our eyeshadow and I did a lot of blending because my eyeshadow was not that pigmented so I had to do like a lot a lot of blending After this, I moved on to add some gold to her eyelids before I added the glitter onto her eyes. This actually helps me like to like make my glitter pop more. Yeah, so yeah. Um, actually, the full video of where I was applying the glitter my camera cut off and I did not notice that it had cut off so you would see where I was like fixing some of the glitter onto her, onto her eyes so I'm really sorry about that I moved on to adding some wing to her eyes.
and then I moved on to adding some lashes I can't remember the brand of lashes that I use um, I can't even find the pack with the name of the lashes because my nephew took it and he lost it so I can't even get the name to mention it but he, it was some cute lashes though I cleaned away all the good stuff on her face and then I moved on to moisturizing the skin and getting it ready I also add some magnesia because she has like really oily skin so yeah I added some magnesia to her face to help me with holding the makeup together. It actually works well. I normally use it on myself, but when I do use it on myself, it doesn't actually like hold my makeup. I don't know. But it did a great job. Her skin wasn't wasn't oily any at all. And we did her photo shoot like midday so it was like really 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 hot but the makeup kept together really really sweet I worked the magnesia into her skin and then I moved on to adding foundation to her skin her face actually has like a lot of blemishes so I couldn't find my orange corrector anywhere so I had to do like two coats of foundation yeah that actually helped to like you know hide away some of her black spots but yeah She had a lot of spectators so you'll actually see her talking a lot in the video and you know skin and her face or whatever but she had a lot of spectators so she was a bit anxious and she was talking way too much Then I moved on to concealing under her eyes, her forehead, her nose, her chin. Funny that I was so 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 trying to hurry up because her photo shoot was in an hour. I did not even realize that the first concealer that I used was really dark for her skin. I only realized that after I applied it to her face and I was like oh my god what am I doing but then I add some fawn to it it kind of helped you know it helped me but then you will see me going with a lighter foundation because I didn't think that you know her under eyes were really highlighted the way that I wanted it to look so You'd see me going in with yes, you would see me going in with a lighter foundation using my spoolie to apply it. Because if you look very closely, you would actually see that her under eyes and her nose and her forehead and chin was actually looking a lot darker than her face. So, yeah. But I actually fixed it better off camera. Had, like when we went to the photo shoot I actually fixed it because it was I then move on to 
adding some to setting her on the eyes sorry with some translucent powder and then I moved on to contouring I moved on to wiping away the translucent powder from her forehead, her under eyes, her chin, etc. And to adding some color under her eyes. No. I must talk about this. Her under eyes had given me a lot of trouble. You can see her eyes actually rolling up in her head. She was actually blinking a lot, but yeah, it gave me a lot, a lot, a lot of trouble. So that again, I had to also fix off camera. Her eyes water really badly, so I got some got a, a lot of trouble with that this is the end of my makeup tutorial we'll then move on to photo shoot and some pics the photo shoot was actually a lot of fun big up to my photographer Leandro Nore he's really 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 good big up to my photographer again thank you so much and here is some pictures that I have added I hope you guys enjoyed my first video don't forget to subscribe and like and again thank you for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video bye